there was like an Australian online newspaper and it had it had Colonel Meow that said Catalebrities and then right next to him was Kim Kardashian's face of like some other headline and they were right next to each other the same size and I was like oh my god Hi, my name's Anne-Marie Avey, and I own Colonel Meow. I would say he handles it like he's Brad Pitt, but <laughs> he doesn't really understand. He just thinks like it's normal. If you love your cat, and if you love posting stuff, or making videos, then do it. Let it, the sharing happen organically. And eventually, people like that enough, it will be shared. It's like wildfire. You can't control it. There's no progression, it just happens. The conversation is really about like fascination, like what makes people fascinated. Anything can be a meme if it's unique enough that people want to mimic it and share it. I don't consider him a meme, but if people out there have made him one, and it's great to see. Colonel Meow, I, I love what he has, and he's fluffy as hell and looks angry in 20,000 different ways. It is just like this like ferocious looking massive cat. We walk down Hollywood Boulevard and he just kind of walks around and just have people with their phones like, is that a, what, what is that? It is the most insane looking cat I've ever seen in the best way. He's so cool, he's so fun, and he just doesn't care. You know, he just doesn't care. That little furball of funk. Two shakes. He was abandoned on the side of the road, was taken to a kill shelter, and through the Persian and Himalayan Society, I was able to rescue him. He looked at me with those big eyes. You and me, like, you and I have something, and I need you to step it up right now and get me out. Hmm. I just obeyed. <laughs> I just obeyed which is like any minion would do. With Colonel Meow, he's, uh, he's definitely inspired my writing. He definitely gave me that second chance, like, here you go, look at me, you might as well write something about this. <laughs> the, the social media around Colonel Meow is hilarious. He's um, an ex-colonel, and Scotch is his go-to. He likes a smooth, Johnny Walker Black, one cube, and he just wants to relax and make all the voices go away. The owner has gone and created a personality type around Colonel Meow, this like storyline of like what Colonel Meow likes to do, which is drink scotch. Colonel, for a special occasion, tomorrow, Colonel doesn't give a rip. When people come over, he doesn't scurry and run underneath the bed. He like greets them and is like, welcome to my humble abode, gentlemen. Sit down, relax. I'm gonna look from the top of my cat castle and stare at you all day. Colonel has this piercing stare. I'm like, Colonel, no, I'm not feeding you again. You know, <laughs> he's like, whatever. Fine, I won't snuggle with you later. It's very, it's on his terms, is how we live our life. As humans, we secretly want to have that who gives a care type of thing. We have our Facebook, we have a Twitter, and we have a Tumblr, and we have a Instagram. We just post stuff every day and make some videos. We also have a YouTube account as well. You capture these moments on film with your animal and you share it on the internet. It's like the largest cat park in the world. There's that old joke that uh, cats are popular on the internet because dog users can walk their dogs. How do you share your very like indoors focused cat? People are like, the internet's filled with cats. I'm like, well, because we can't go anywhere else. You're so good. Cats on the internet are just great. They're cats. <laughs> I never expected this attention, and that's really cool to see others love him just as much as you do. What he represents is like a rescued cat, turn your luck around, give the cat a good home, loving home, and that's a great thing. I'm so lucky to have that instant connection with him. When I first saw him, it was like, you need to get this cat, I don't know why. Oh yeah, he's crazy looking, but just get him, just get him, and it'll all work out, and I feel like 
was meant to be. 